Black Lives Matter is a joke. Yep. You are the racist. The racist is you. Yep. It's because yep. the white guy yep. killed that. You yep. think they're racist? The racist the Black Lives Matter. Yep. Go to Chicago. Yeah. They don't have schools. Yeah, yeah, I don't give up. And they die every day. They don't yep. matter. They don't have because water. you can't get attention from that. Go to Shut up. Shut up. Shut up. Nobody will know you're black. Shut matter. up. Group of hypocrites. Go to Southeast DC, Northeast, tell them Black Lives Matter. If it matters, it should matter everywhere. You guys are hypocrites. Attention seekers. Attention seekers. Black lives should matter everywhere. It doesn't take a white cop to kill a black person to matter. So I'm here today because I heard about a demonstration on, you know, the George Floyd event, on um, the situation, which I'm going to be honest about it. It's wrong that, you know, anything like that should happen. Okay? It's very wrong. My problem is it shouldn't, it shouldn't be an opportunity for a group of people to use that as an excuse or to come across as victims. No one is a victim here. The only victim here is George Floyd. Let's be very clear. Everybody knows that black kills black more than anything. You know that. It doesn't take a white person to kill them for you to come out. Hypocrites. Just leave. You leave. I'm present. Let you leave. leave. Let me leave. I don't want to make, make me leave. Bunch of hypocrites. Black lives matter only when a white person touch a black person. Do you know how many black kids got killed in Northeast DC this morning? What did you do? You guys are the racist. What did you do besides come out here and provoke shit? No, go out there. Then, tell go out there and help. Go out there and help them. Go tell the black person black lives matter. Then they will take you seriously. Everybody right, thinks you guys are a joke. You a joke. Cause you playing. Go out no, there and do it. A joke. You a joke. What are you doing for the Chicago kids who are dying every day? What you doing? Do you go there and tell them black lives matter? You going? Make me go! You go! Make me go! You're so supportive but I'm going! Make me go! As an American citizen, I'm proud of this country. I love this country. I don't want my country to be portrayed like this. We have a problem. That agreed. We have a problem in our country. Agreed. Okay? Too much violence. But it should not be categorized as a, as a symbolism for racism on blacks. No! We are in a free country. Let me be very clear. We have foreign news media here. Our country is going to be portrayed the way they want our country to be portrayed and which is not accurate. My point was that black kids in Chicago get killed every single day. Where is the Black Lives Matter in Chicago? Where are they? When black people kill black people, they don't come out and do this crap. The only time they do this crap is when a white person touches them. They are the racist. They are the racist because white, people, white cops it's wrong for a white cop to kill a black person, that's for sure. But if it matters, it shouldn't matter at all times. So what are you fighting for? What are you fighting for? You are not here to fight injustice. You're here a to cause drama. better will be stop violence. It's not about blacks. In a unicorn world. That's stop not a unicorn violence, world. Period. Okay, since you're so... You guys think so so blacks are oppressed. I am black, I'm not oppressed. That's I am for you. free. That's good for you. That's an individual person. What about a systemic issue? Where? I am black. I've always wanted to be. I have a like. I do what I want. You have the skills. This is a country where you have the skills. You want to do what you want. You do it. Okay. Stop. Stop forcing on people to accept that they're oppressed. They are not. I am not oppressed. I am black. That's right. That's right. Stop making that. people accept that they're oppressed. You're forcing a rhetoric into your mind, which is not true. That's my point. Okay. Violence is wrong. Period. It's not about blacks. Of course. You agree that whites kill black whites too, right? Of course. Have you seen any white person coming out and saying white life matter or white thing? No. They violence do. is wrong. They literally do all the time. Every time there's a black violence, lives matter it's a protest, violence problem. a white it's not person. A black but problem. It's a violence problem. The blacks kill blacks in black neighborhoods every single day. I have never seen a black life matter in those neighborhoods. Never. Never. You know what they say? When the black person kills a black in a black neighborhood, they come out and they say, when the police comes, do you know what they tell the police? Snitches get stitches. Snitches get stitches. But if a white person kills a black person, black lives matter. Stop the hypocrisy. Nobody takes this seriously. Nobody. If it matters, it should matter in black neighborhoods. You start cleaning at home. Why don't you go? You Why, don't you start? At home. Why don't you start? I'm not carrying anything Why saying Black Lives Matter. I know I matter. Why don't you start? You guys are wasting everybody's time. Okay? Since you're so black you about black this. more than any race. Where is the Black Lives Matter? People kill in their community. Where is the Black Lives Matter? I am free. Don't try to make me free if I'm not free. I am free. We are free. Shame on you. I am free. We are free. Shame on you. Shame on you. Shame on you. I am free. I am free. I am free. Bring it. Bring it, guys. Bring it. Bring it. Bring it. Why are you here? Why are you here? Why are you here? I am free in my country. 
country. Why are you here? I'm in my country. Why are you here? Okay, so if you don't believe in this cause, you're free to leave. You're free. So you're free to leave. I am free to stay too. I am free to stay. That's my house. White house. Then go there. Black lives matter. Black lives matter. You know how many kids got killed in North DC this, this morning? Let's hear the statistics. Since you're such a stats expert and you can read stats off for me, tell me what are the statistics? What are the statistics of black people in jail? What are the statistics? Go. And what are the statistics of black people dying in Chicago every day? Where are you? Bunch of hypocrites. Bunch of hypocrites. Don't waste anybody's time. I would. You know what? You know what, guys? You believe in this and you're wasting your own time. No, I will tell you guys. The world will tell you guys seriously. When you start your Black Lives Movement, when a black person kills a black person, you come out and say, Black Lives Matter, there we are, all respect. There are community organizations that fight against that. You have no idea. Where? Where? Everyone, everyone, let's march. Let's march. Let's start this march. Black Lives Matter. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go to no peace. Let's go to no peace. Let's go to North East. I, I will go with you. I will go. Let's do it in South East DC. I will respect your movement. Do, not do it in Chicago. I will respect you, Chicago. You guys have been cowards. You guys are not oppressed. You're lazy. That's all it is. Go get jobs. Work. I am oppressed. The white people are oppressing me. Why are they to oppress you? Do you feel like the mainstream media or the establishment media is portraying things accurately or the protests accurately? No. What I think is that the mainstream media is helping propel this voice which, which is very, very skewed from reality. Okay, because the mainstream media can help, help them look at things from that perspective. Why don't you start at home, bring the numbers to their attention? Here are the numbers, they don't lie. African Americans kill each other more than anything. These are numbers. If, how about you start the change at home? How about that? Why does it need take a white person to kill a black person for them to come out? Oh my gosh, it's the end of the world. How about that? Why don't nobody bring that perspective to, the, to their face? Is it ignorance? What is it? Is it deceit? Is it deceit? What, what are they trying to achieve? This is common sense. You want to change? Start the change at home. Common sense. You don't need to be a nuclear physician to, to get this easy. Start the change at home. Period. And let the mainstream media tell them the things the way they are. Hey, yeah, we agree with you. Violence is wrong. In any way, on any surface of the earth, violence is wrong. But there's more violence in your own communities. What do you do about that? Are you going to come change violence at the White House? Come on, give us a break. The idea is to, to create a group of people who feel oppressed, okay? Because if the, the more they feel oppressed, the more they're going to, to look for some kind of equalization. They look, nobody's oppressed in America. Look, I'm a foreigner. I, first of all, all Americans, we're all foreigners, okay? If I'm hardworking, America is a country of... Why do you think they didn't tell World War to come to our country? Okay? We, everybody wants to come to America and they want to pretend we're oppressed. I am not oppressed. I'm black. I'm not oppressed. I have a master's in health administration. Okay, I'm going to be working for a federal agency. I am not oppressed. No black in America. I don't feel oppressed. I'll tell you that. If you, you, you're driven, you're going to get accomplished what you want to accomplish. We're in the country of the free. Okay? And let the mainstream media stop trying to force in on people to accept that they're oppressed. I am not oppressed. I am black. I am not oppressed. Okay? Trying to make some people feel oppressed is just to weaken them. That's the bottom line. You want to make this group of black people feel that they're weak and that there's some, some power on top of the No one is oppressing nobody.